In this tutorial, you're going to learn how to use a master page. In a master page, we place all the content we use throughout all the pages of your website, like, for example, the logo or the menu or the footer. This means that you just have to design these elements once and then you apply the master page to all the pages. So, for example, in this page, I've created two master pages. The only difference is the color of the menu. Here, in A master, you know, we won't be able to see it, but this is the menu and you can't see the font because it's a white color. And in B master, I've changed it to purple. It's just because of the, the, the background, the, the image, it won't contrast. So, to apply the, the pages, I mean, to apply the master page to the rest of the pages, the only thing you have to do is is drag and drop. So by default, you'll get the A master applied to the rest of the pages, but I just want A master to be here and in the in the home page and the rest of the pages, the internal pages, I want B master. So the only thing you have to do is click on it and drag on top. See how it changes color? So just let go and it will apply on its own. See, services has B master page. So you have to do the same to the rest of the pages. And you're done. So the thing is that if you have to make any changes, you just have to open the master page and make the changes you need and it will automatically up update. So for example, here in B master, just imagine if you want to put the, the logo a bit bigger. Well, this is a font, so I'm going to make the font bigger. Let's say it's up to 150. Okay. So we go back here and see how the services about us and context will update. See, services is already updated. About us will be updated now and then contact. Okay, so that's it. So... You can create as many master pages as you want, but normally in, in a website, I think two is enough or even three. I normally have one master page for the, the home page and then a different master page for the internal pages. To create another master page, what you have to do is just hover over the, the master page and then click here, so you can create an add one. So it'll, it'll follow the alphabet. It will be A master, B master, and C master. So you can do as many as you want, and then to delete them, you just have to click on the X, and that's it.